Top 5 Ghosts Caught on Camera Stadium Ghost The Tomas Adolfo Duco Stadium in Argentina is home to the soccer team The Hurricane, but according to one night security guard at the field, the stadium is also home to something else. The security guard had been hearing strange noises and seeing things move on their own around the stadium. This had occurred several nights in a row. Late one night, he hears strange banging noises coming from the locker rooms below the stadium. So, he decides to investigate. Using his cell phone, he records a very scary video of what he claims is a real ghost caught on camera. Bueno, este, ya son como las 11 de la noche y la, la tercera vez que estoy escuchando este ruido de mierda. <coughs> No sé qué está pasando, pero lo quiero grabar ahora para que después me crea la gente, porque esto nunca me pasó y, y nada, lo quería grabar. No sé yo, estoy podrido, la concha de la luz. Tengo una linterna para que viera la gente. Dios. Puta que te parió. que te parió concha de la lora la concha de la lora pero como mierda puede ser que no haya nada hoy ya es la tercera vez tercera vez que entro y no hay nada Dios, me quiero ir, me quiero ir, the night guard seems to completely miss the bizarre shadow that passes right in front of him. Hoy, ya la tercera vez. Many who have seen the scary ghost video think that it could be the spirit of Renee Hausman, a former Hurricane player who passed away just a few weeks before the video was shot. But what do you think? Is it fake or is it a real ghost caught on tape? Let me know in the comments. Ghost at Grandma's A man in Canada has recently moved into his deceased grandma's old house. He wakes in the middle of the night hearing strange noises that don't seem to stop. So he pulls out his phone to document the sounds, but he ends up getting far more than strange bumps in the night in this bizarre ghost video. Okay, it's like midnight right now. I was sleeping on my couch and I heard a loud bang. I've heard it before, but I didn't know what it was. I just thought it was the dogs on the deck or something. But I think if I sit and wait, you'll see. I just seen it. I don't know what it is. I have no idea what it is. are opening and slamming on their own and mysteriously the light in the kitchen has been turned on by someone can I get up and... Ooh, I'm just shaking look at my goosebumps okay hmm it's my grandma's old house too it's it's old I remember that light being on I 
Let's see what this looks like. I don't want to go too close to. That's just creepy. You have no idea. Like, there's nobody in my house right now. Like, nobody. I can hear something in that room. <sighs> okay. That's weird. What is that? Somebody's in that room. Ha! Whoa! Okay. Look at those goosebumps. I'm gonna go look. What's worse that's gonna happen? Ooh, it's scary. There's like nobody in here. I'm freaking out, man. This is scary. This is really scary. I knew I could hear stuff before. But I don't know. It's so weird. Like, I could hear it. Oh. I'm going outside. <sighs> As the strange paranormal activity gets even worse, he just decides to get out of there. So is this a ghost caught on camera? Is it paranormal activity? You decide. I'm going outside. Little girl ghost. Another great ghost caught on camera video out of Monterey, Mexico. Beto Ortega was hospitalized after a severe heart attack. He lapsed in and out of a coma for several days. Ortega says that while he was in the coma, he had recurring dreams of a disturbing young girl who offered to heal him. Mysteriously, the girl in his dream said, quote, I have a stuffed animal for you, and when you receive it, you will be healed. When Ortega awoke from his coma, things got even creepier. You see, his wife had something for him, a stuffed animal. She said that, quote, a young girl came by the hospital and gave me this stuffed animal and said, give it to the gentleman so that he can be cured. As he lay unconscious, his wife laid the stuffed doll in his room near his hospital bed. After recovering fully, Beto Ortega returned to his home and things became even more bizarre. Strange supernatural events began to take place around his home. The stuffed animal that the mystery girl had given him would randomly fall off shelves. He would hear strange noises and things around the house would mysteriously move on their own. Ortega became convinced that the little girl from his hospital dreams had followed him home, somehow attached to him from the other side. The majority of the strange events happened in the room occupied by his two young sons, as if the girl were drawn to the other children. Not wanting to frighten his sons, Ortega would record video only when his sons were asleep in the other room or not at home. In this video, we see Ortega giving a tour of his son's room. He doesn't even notice, but a toy in the room moves on its own. In a later video, Beto Ortega returns to his home, this time with candles and incense. He says that a local psychic medium has advised him that this is the best way to cleanse the spirit from the house. He places the stuffed animal that the little girl gave him at the head of the bed in his son's room. But it doesn't work out so well. Esta es mi casa. Yo soy el dueño. Me llamo Jorge. Si aún sigues aquí, me dijeron que eres la niña que me dio el peluche cuando yo estaba internado. Sigues aquí. 
sigues aquí todavía presente con nosotros. Dios, se cayó el peluche. Dios, se cayó el peluche. Me dijeron que no tuviera miedo, que no era mal. Sigues aquí con nosotros todavía. Me dijeron que la niña ocupaba algo. ¿Quieres platicar conmigo? Me dijeron que necesitabas algo. Voy a entrecerrar la puerta. Te voy a hacer algunas preguntas y tratar de captar lo que necesitas. No quiero hacerte daño, no quiero que me hagas daño ni a mi familia. Voy a cerrar un poquito la puerta. Te dejé esa luz para que puedas llegar. Yo me llamo Jorge, esta es mi casa. Eres la niña que me dio el peluche en el hospital. ¿Estás aquí conmigo? Eres la niña, esa niña hermosa que viene el sueño, que me dio el peluche para que, me, para que yo me curara. Dios santo. Dios dijo hola Estás Yo no queremos hacerte daño Eres esa niña El niño hermoso que me dio el peluche Estás aquí con nosotros Conmigo Dios santo No, no, no Dios santo Salí corriendo pero es por mis hijos Estás perdida Ocupas algo Necesitas algo Dime, si yo puedo ayudarte Con gusto lo haré Ocupas algo Estás, Necesitas algo Su mamá Dijo su mamá Dice Dios No Sí te escuché, te escuché que ocupabas a tu mamá, no sé en qué más, no sé cómo ayudarte. Hay alguien que viene conmigo que te va a poder ayudar. Voy a cerrar la puerta para venir con esta persona, para tratar de ayudarte, ¿ok? Dios, ¿cómo pudieron oír? Así está aquí la niña, es una niña chiquita, tratando, no sé, tengo miedo, la verdad... Tratando los que hicieron. Dios. Los cienciazos me dijeron que pudiera invo invocar. Voy a abrir la puerta. No te voy a hacer daño. No quiero que me hagas daño. Oye, quieres a tu mami. Trataremos de hacer lo posible, ¿ok? Si tú eres la... Dios santo. Dios, Dios. There's a strange black shadow sitting in the far corner of the bed. Si tú eres la... Dios santo. Dios, Dios. So is this a ghost caught on camera? Or is it an elaborate fake? Let me know what you think down in the video comments. Lights out. The man who uploaded this video claims that his house is haunted by a former tenant. He says that he often experiences strange electrical problems in his home and hears bizarre sounds at all hours of the night. However, he says he's never been able to document one of the incidents. Until now. One night, he's home alone when suddenly his electricity goes out for no reason. He begins to hear strange noises, so he grabs his video camera and a flashlight. <laughs> 
So is this a wailing ghost caught on camera? <laughs> or just another hoax? You decide. Plain shadow ghost caught on camera. A security guard for the small Mexican airlines Aero Mexico receives reports of strange noises coming from one of the planes. He goes to investigate. As he searches through the dark abandoned plane, his body cam catches all the action, including what could be a ghost caught on tape. Verga. ¿Qué fue eso? No mames. As you can see in the video, the security guard checks up and down the plane, but nothing there. Then, he turns back toward the area where he's already searched. And something, dark and foreboding, is peeking back at him. Now, what would you do if you were alone at night on a plane and saw this strange thing peeking around the corner at you? Let me know down in the comments.